So in the previous video, we saw that the integral between 0 and 1 of 1 over x squared was undefined. That was um, divergent. So how about if we've got 1 over the square root of x? What happens then? So this would be the limit as a tends to 0, okay, because when x is 0, the function's undefined. That's why it's an improper integral. The integral between a and 1 of x to the power of minus a half dx. So this is equal to the limit as a tends to 0 of... So add 1 to the power divided by the new power. So we're going to get, um, add 1 to the power is a half, divide by a half is times by 2. So 2x two, uh, to the half, so 2 root x. Evaluate between a and 1. So this is the limit as a tends to 0. Substitute in the 1, we get 2. Substitute in a, we get 2 root a. And as a tends to 0, the square root of a tends to 0. So this is going to be equal to 2. So it turns out that the integral between 0 and 1 of 1 over root x is actually equal to 2. So this one is defined.